Welcome to this video in which I test the Carousel V2. The diaper comes from the ABDL shop and is still rather unknown according to my impression, but that does not make it less interesting. Promised is a rather thick, wide-cut diaper, which is discreetly colorful printed and should feel soft with foil. The outer foil is a little softer than you know it from others, I find positive. A little in the direction of retro foil diapers, but only a little, it seems like a kind of mix of classic and new foil, so it also feels a little smooth. My impression of the outer material is, it takes a little getting used to, after two or three diapers I found it comfortable. Visually it is kept in white, colorful printed the front. Over the prints is a stronger film, on which you stick the plastic reusable stickers. In addition, the pages were colored in a mixture of blue and a light pink. These colorful lines run across the entire diaper and are therefore not only rather invisible between the legs, but also visible in the front and back. I like this design with the two colored lines. It freshens up the look a bit without making the diaper completely colorful right away. Because the rest of the area below the adhesive surface up to the bottom is white. A nice detail for a rather discreet, but still printed with childlike motifs diaper. Whereby this is of course nothing that you can objectively test or judge. How much printing you want on a diaper and what motifs and colors is a matter of taste. What can be said? The prints are less contrasty, as with the rear's critter caboose, but still significantly stronger than is now the case with pampers. The adhesives can be resealed and make a stable impression. When putting on you notice that it is quite a wide-cut diaper and you have noticeably much material between the legs. When squeezing the legs, folds, the diaper thereby a little. This gives a feeling of security and some like that certainly. You may have seen it in the distance between the glues, the diaper comes out a tiny bit larger, like others in M, but not too much, it's not a comparison to North Shore Megamax, where M is more like L, it should therefore fit most people. It should therefore fit most people who wear M. The Carousel V2 is unimpressed by urine, even in larger quantities it is absorbed quickly and is not distributed so much at the beginning. Only when the diaper is fuller it goes further back, this is normal. It is important that everything fits well. If the diaper or in the diaper sits a little awkwardly, it can leak out the sides. Again, this is not a problem with this diaper in particular but is the case with all of them. No matter how thick and absorbent they are, this only helps if everything fits. A fresh carousel diaper weighs 214 grams, which is already in the upper field compared to others and confirms as I said before that you have quite a lot of material between your legs. When she started with drops, the diaper has weighed about 1.8 kilograms, not a best performance, but even that is a good value that not everyone manages. Especially since I would not see this alone, but always in relation to the price and other things that a diaper offers. Price-wise, it currently costs 28.90 euros per pack of 10 diapers, so you have to pay 2.89 euros for a single one. That doesn't seem like a bargain price, at least, when you think about the critter caboose I talked about earlier, for example, at 2.74 euros each, it costs 15 cents less and is technically somewhat better. Of course, one can argue about the motifs and also the type of printing, the caboose is printed quite differently and is complete. The carousel also only advertises 5 liters of suction power, while the rears has 8 liters, so it's understandable why the carousel scores a bit lower. However, the fact that it is a bit more expensive compared to the offered performance does not change anything. In any case, I find it positive that it has kept its promises, it is pleasant on the outside with a smooth and yet somewhat soft film, at least for my taste. That this diaper is supposed to be extra soft on the inside again, I can't confirm. Which is not to say that it feels bad on the inside, it also feels good on the inside, but so do others. Wide cut it is also, which I find pleasant, because I like to be wrapped thickly, if you can feel this, it gives a sense of security. A thicker diaper can of course absorb better than a thinner one. From the feel of it, I would have even expected this diaper to be able to hold a little more, my estimate was at least 2 kilograms. It didn't quite manage that. It was because it was already very soaked in the front and between the legs. Although I kept sitting down in between, the bottom got a little wetter, but not as much. There would still have been dry sucking surface at the back. How that behaves exactly with you, also depends on how you wear it. Because when standing, such a diaper can often withstand a lot more, because the liquid can be distributed without pressure. It is only when you sit that the absorbent pad is compressed. You can imagine this as a wet sponge, if you need it, the water is also pressed out. If the diaper is not yet so full, it can spread inside until it is absorbed at another place, or it doesn't even matter, because the diaper is only wet at the front and not yet at the back. If high absorbency is enough for you instead of the highest and you like the feeling of being wrapped up thickly, 
then the carousel can be an interesting diaper for you, at least if you like the design, which brings us back to the topic of taste. If it all fits, it doesn't have to be worse or even bad. Other things are more important to everyone. Some people cannot or do not want to wear a diaper until it reaches 2 kilograms or more. In that case, it may not matter if it can withstand a few hundred grams less. And if you like the design or feel, I can also fully understand that you choose this diaper. It should also be said that the surcharge is still comparatively low compared to other manufacturers such as Abu, which have made their diapers much more expensive. The few cents in the carousel I consider against it still in an absolutely justifiable range. What do you think of the diaper? Why is it interesting for you or what speaks against it from your point of view? Feel free to write a comment with your opinion. If you liked my video, I would be very happy about a thumbs up. On the side you will find more tests. I have already tried some other diapers. If you didn't like the Carousel V2 or are interested in new diapers, feel free to check out my other videos, there's sure to be something for you there. And if you don't want to miss any diaper video, I recommend you to leave a subscription for my channel there. It costs you nothing, by subscribing you will be notified when I upload a new video. Stay dry, until next time.